Hi everyone, Eric Shoji here coming to you from Russia where I'm currently playing my professional volleyball season. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about something that I wish I was so much better at when I was younger and that is being okay with asking for help. I remember when I was young I was so scared to ask my teachers, my coaches, and even my own family members for help thinking that if I did that I just wasn't good enough and I can remember specifically not reaching out to my English teachers in high school because I didn't want them to read my essays because I didn't want them to think that I was a dumb volleyball player or a dumb jock or not smart enough to go to Stanford. But let me tell you, this mentality is so, so wrong. Asking for help is not a weakness. In my opinion, it's actually a strength to have when you're young and throughout life. Now, let me tell you, I do think there are certain things that you're going to have to figure out on your own, but in general and in most cases, asking for help is 100% okay. I think it shows that you want to get better, you want to improve, and that you're willing to step out of your comfort zone to go the extra mile to get better. And I also think it shows that you're willing to build relationships with people that maybe you normally wouldn't have. So asking for help is a great thing. Never think it's a weakness always think it's a strength. I ask for help here in Russia almost every single day and it's something that I've gotten so much better at as I've gotten older. So get out there, ask for help from your teachers and coaches. They really do want to help you. In fact, they're probably paid to help you. So take advantage of it. Get out there, play some volleyball, have some fun, ask questions, ask for help. And if you want to reach out to me, don't be afraid to send me a message on Instagram or through my YouTube channel, I always respond. I hope you all have a great day. See you soon, bye.